If your course has a lot of learning content, resources and activities, it's sometimes more attractive to add a course banner or some images in the sections or in the blocks to make it easier on the eye. There are two ways to add an image to your Moodle course. Both of them need you to have the editing turned on, either by clicking the button top right or by scrolling down and the in the administration block, clicking the link, turn editing on. If at the top of your course page you then see a message saying that you can drag and drop files, you can use the first method. If you don't see that, you can use the second method. In this video, we'll look at two ways to add images to your course page. In the section on reading, I'm going to add a little icon which I have over on the right here on my desktop. When you're adding images, it's important to make sure that you have permission to add them or that they're Creative Commons or Public Domain. It's useful also to get them the right size for your Moodle course before you upload them. So because I'm able to drag and drop images, I simply put my cursor on the image, click to hold it and then drag it into the reading section here. What happens then is I'm given a message asking whether I want to add it to the course page to be displayed directly or make a file resource. Someone would then have to click on it to access it. I want to add it straight to the course page. So I click upload and then it's uploaded down here. And if I want it at the top, I simply click on the icon to drag it up. If you're not able to drag and drop, let's look at the second method. I want to add an image in the listening section of my course and I'm going to add it to the topic summary. So I click the configure icon, which is different according to the theme that you're using. And this takes me to the text editor, the tiny MCE text editor, where I click the icon which looks a bit like a tree. It's the icon for uploading an image. And when I click on it, I'm brought to a box where I click the button Find or Upload an Image. This takes us to Moodle's File Picker, which we look at in a separate video. I simply want to upload my chosen image from my computer. So I choose Upload a File and then I click the button which says Choose File or Browse, depending on the browser you're using, to go to my computer to pick the image that I want. I can save it with a different name if I want, change the author if I want, change the license if it's not appropriate, and then click the button Upload this file. Now there are other options in terms of appearance, if I want it to be aligned to the right or left of some text and so on. It's important to give it a description. And then we simply click Insert scroll down and save the changes and our image is displayed. So that's two ways of adding images to your course page by drag and drop or by using the icon in the tiny MCE text editor.